Okay, so some of you are interested in seeing me writing a song without having a guitar in my hand, so let's start. Uh, so I've already got set up a guitar profile, I've already set up a D standard guitar, which is what we decided we were going to write in. I've already set the tempo to 150, and we're going to just kind of go for it. No idea what's going to happen, but let's have a go. Uh, the only thing I will hear is a metronome for timing, so 150. Okay, so I've got a rough idea of that. So we're probably going to do something rhythmic to start with, let's think. So we're going to probably have some kind of galloping rhythm thing. Um, so let's have something like... Dun, dun, dun. So I know what certain patterns are going to sound like, so I know that that's the galloping, it's going to be... Dun, dun, dun. So with that line there is... Dun, 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 dun. Have a bomb bomb. Oops. Uh, yep. So we've got da 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 da. Let's have da 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 da. Break. Bomb 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 bomb. Da 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 da. Break. Let's have better down. Let's have that as a bend. Let's have it as pinch harmonic. So what I'm mainly doing is thinking more about the rhythms and I roughly know what notes will sound like. Uh, so by learning lots of music I can tell kind of what a gallop phrase is going to look like. So let's copy that across, have that again, have that again, but let's change it. Da -da. Let's carry on with it again, repeat again, we're going to repeat that one again, and then we're going to change the end. Did a little. And let's have. Let's do a duo. So let's have that as the intro. Lovely. Lovely. What next? Let's have. Ding, 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 ding. Reverse. So let's have some kind of polyrhythm going on now. So we're going to have the guitars doing a triplet groove. We're going to have a little bend on the three. And go boom, 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 Yeah, so we're going to go for kind of a triplet groove as say over a drum groove. Currently, this should sound like down, 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 down. So we're going to keep running with that idea, and the idea is going to have the drums underneath, kind of down, sugar style, four, four on the hat. We kick drum can follow. Yeah, we have a kick drum following. We have snare and hats doing two and four. Take more of it. Yeah, so repeat that. So bam, 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 Okay, so let's let's go for a verse in five, four, sort of thing. So we're going to take that pre-verse idea first. Bam, 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 It's going to sound really wonky, I have a feeling. Let's have alternating bars between 5 4 and 4 4. First. Couldn't change my mind, so that's 6 4. <sighs> Let's do that again. We'll leave that as a verse for now, so that we're going to go for. Pre chorus. <sighs> So underneath the pre-chorus we're going to have power chords and then, oh no, we're not in drop D, we're in standard. 
need to have some kind of tappy thing going on. Alright, so chorus now. What should we do for a chorus? Well, how about we go back and well, let's keep it straight, Phil, because we did a lot of triplets here. So let's go for something straight. Let's get some kind of chord progression first. So we're going to go boom. Let's just do it as like three bar phrases, just to be different. On top of that, what, let's have something like boom, 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 Take it from here in the intro. We're going to take it across and take all of that. We'll track copy special paste. So I'm kind of starting to build up the form now. So we've got intro, pre verse, verse, pre chorus, chorus. We go back to the intro but this is kind of like a part intro so you're using the same things but you're kind of changing it a bit by cutting it down it okay we're back i've pre-filled in what got deleted and we're good to go again so what i was saying is we're gonna go and take part way through our intro and take it all copy it across Crashed, crashed, and crash. Great. Uh, so we've now got like an intro, pre verse, verse, pre chorus, chorus, re intro, shortened, pre verse, verse, pre chorus, chorus. So here, you know, I could say, right, let's double up this chorus. Oh, we need to change that. So this bar has got a different chord underneath, so what we're going to do. Um, could drop it there, but. Um, let's change that to do, do, do. So that's kind of matching it with that. But that should be more in key. Right, let's carry on. So yeah, let's have a double chorus. We'll try copies, which one? Some kind of bridge. So let's change up for the bridge and do something in 5-4. So let's just do like some kind of weird pull-off idea. So let's go with it open to make it easy to transition to. Do, do. Let's go with that. So I don't want that quite that fast. Let's go with that. You go that. Do, 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 do. Cool. Go okay with that. No idea what it's going to sound like. For the repeat, let's go up a tritone. Cool. So that's a rough bridge and finish off let's go let's take that and then so we've kind of got the little like a bridge that we've already had before in the song so yeah let's go for that and then a double chorus and we'll call it a day and let's just have a stab on the end for good measure okay so this is just through my speakers at the moment with the midi but let's have a listen <laughs> stick with it. That should have been a power chord but yeah it kind of works. Again I thought I was in drop tuning. Oh well. 
kind of works. So kind of um, perfect fourths instead of power chords. <laughs> Estimate how fast that's going to be. Good luck to me. Uh, it's going into second verse. quite nicely there. But there we go, chorus time. luck to me. So I'm going to kind of fill in the rest of drums and bass and so on. Uh, I won't go through that in this video because it'll be quite long. But yeah, let's see what it turns out like recorded.